We just had a very lovely uh, talk from uh, Theo DeWitt about the EU MDS registry, which has the largest experience of measuring quality of life, at least using the EQ5D instrument in MDS patients. And what you can see is that there's a significant impairment in quality of life um, in many symptom and function domains. Um, in comparison to age match controls who don't have MDS. And by uh, multivariate analysis, uh, anemia and transfusion dependence are independently prognostic of the global uh, quality of life score, at least measured by the EQ5D that's calculated. So we know that patients with MDS who are anemic and or transfusion dependent endure worse quality of life. We also know that uh, there, is, there is evidence that the improvement in hemoglobin that's achieved by transfusions does translate into tr improved global quality of life as reflected by instruments like the FACT anemia um, and the FACET fatigue score. Um, uh, there's a, a nice study, in fact, that shows that the, amount, uh, the distance that patients can walk in the six meter walk test improves a week after receiving a blood transfusion.